Adam Freeland Show, ladies and gentlemen, the date, July 27th, 2022, and Joe Biden has tested negative for COVID-19 after only being sick for five days. Our president persevered, right? He overcame. Okay, yeah. yeah. So let's okay. uh, let's go back to the thing, and then I'll just I'll get uh, well. There's we'll that little cat scratch fever playing again. Okay, because cat scratch fever. I thought you know he's the president getting over corona. Cat scratch fever. Chinese people eating cats. I see it. I see it's the logic. Same, yeah. yeah, yeah. I got you. It's kind of like a you. corona theme song. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I never put that together, but it's true. Why well, isn't that the whole? Didn't the Nuge, didn't come the out? The really called it. Yeah. Just a quick reminder, the former guy, he spent, are you ready for this? Drum roll, please. He spent that same amount of time in the fucking hospital, like a goddamn coward pussy, a regular poly dog bitch boy. How's that feel, Corn Top? It's po- pony dog. What's Paul? Remember when he called that guy pony dog? Oh, yeah. He's sorry. Like, what's up? What's up, pony dog? Sorry. Listen, fat, you pony dog bastard brat. Fuck. Fat. Was that the, the listen fat guy? Listen fat. The, pu- the push up contest guy. Yeah. Yeah, well, yeah. I'll do a pu- I'll do a I'll do a book report right now for push up. We'll have a book report off. What is a pony dog? Listen, pony. Well, there's different animals back when he was growing up. Oh, no. It's literally a dog that's so big that a child could ride on it like a pony. Oh. That's what that's what it is. Jill's a big fan of pony dogs. When I I used to go on vacation for years, I'd be out I'd be out I'd be out making deals in China. Jill would be home with the pony dog, getting piped down. Damn, getting piped down by the pony dog. We had (laughs) we got a German Shepherd now. They don't make pony dogs anymore. They don't make them anymore. And the Jill Jill ran through all of them. Yeah, they had to fuck guys instead of these. uh, Every single one of them. They all drowned in Jill's pussy (laughs) juice. All right. So while Biden spent five days at his desk, dutifully signing any paper that was placed in front of him and doing his best to make his eyes track towards whatever camera he was supposed to be smiling at, Donald Trump's bout with COVID saw him airlifted by helicopter to Walter Reed Hospital. Of course, Trump is so goddamn fat that by the time they even got there, the helicopter was short of breath. Even the helicopter was short of breath, folks. Mm -hmm. (laughs) Mm-hmm. Because he's, uh oh, because he's fat. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. We'll get the, the beat. problem is you hit the you hit the intro song button, and that thing does not stop. Well, is it still playing right now? It's still playing. So I, I I'm gonna need the. Okay. All right. All right. Let's get it. Yeah. Let's brass let's, tax. Brass tax. Now Trump is so goddamn fat. By the time they got him there, even the <laughs> helicopter was short of breath. Now that's we're, right. We don't say f- on this show anymore. We don't say we don't, we don't say, say that f- word. We don't say f- as an homage to Mr. George f- it Carlin. <laughs> oh man, he yeah. is turning in his grave. His classic bit: the seven words you can't shove up my <laughs> cock, <laughs> f- <laughs> n- <laughs> bitch, sh- f- and c- caca. Yeah. I know that bit is pretty good. Yeah, anyways. Now, we're having fun here laughing at the orange. Nick. Go ahead. Now, we're having fun here laughing at the orange in chief. It's important to remember that COVID is not a joke. While Trump's probably one of the most uniquely unhealthy individuals on the planet, both physically and mentally, he's not dissimilar from a lot of Americans. What we're saying here, folks, is that a lot of Americans, they got shitty bodies like Donald Trump. We can laugh at a statue in Union Square of him and his tiny penis, you know, but the reality is a lot of a lot of you, a lot of your loved ones, they got the same exact body type as Donald Trump, mm-hmm. the same kind of medical issues. That's right. So when over 97% of Americans are obese. Yes. And it's that's, a sad truth. And if you factor out Hispanic Ameri- non-white no. Hispanic. Well, okay. We're still dealing with 70 to 72 percent. Yeah. And okay. so I haven't looked it up. But. So when people say COVID, you know, not, you know, it's it's just a cold. It's not just a cold because most of us are we look like Donald Trump, you know. Correct. So and maybe I'm sorry. Maybe that was clear already. Yeah. Yeah. I think that's that's what the because I don't want to make it seem I don't want to say I don't want to make it seem like. Do- Americans are like Donald Trump, mm-hmm. who's a bad guy. 
Not as a guy, but as a, a fat piece of as shit. As a fat piece of shit, yeah, yes. Yeah. Most Americans are fat piece of shit, but heart of gold. Mm-hmm. Whereas Donald Trump, fat yeah. piece of Salt shit. Salt of the earth. Worse than me for some reason. Yes, Even correct. though in my personal life, I'm... Uh, you're having... You're allergic to something. To your cat. Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. Well, um, this won't be prior after this week. Folks, yeah, that's... Uh, this is probably the last episode mm-hmm. that we will be recording at Nick's apartment. Yeah. Because big news yesterday... We can pick up the keys tonight. We say... We signed the lease. Yeah. We have... Lease is signed. We have a completely empty studio in Chelsea. Well, don't tell them too much. I'm not going to tell them the address. Stay, stay excited, mm-hmm. folks. Perhaps... A special release this weekend. Correct. At patreon.com slash come yeah, Soon to be some type of Adam Friedland show rebrand. We got, um, we got big plans for this next episode coming out on Patreon. And uh, you guys are definitely going to want to sign up. Yeah. For so that. anyways, back to anyway. the top of the show. While COVID is still very serious, the president's quick recovery proves that it doesn't have to be so long as you're quadruple vaccinated. And there's a plan in place. To have you die by other means next month. The CIA. The CIA. If a 79-year-old could beat this thing with the right medicine, then most of us can. Granted, Joe Biden is one tough, smart bastard. It's easy to overlook his hard scrabble Scranton upbringing, spending the entire winter slathered in oil, crawling to school on all fours, with nothing but a leather body suit to keep him warm. But when you see him now as an old man, you almost forget that this guy... Is tough as nails. It would be foolish to think his undeniable resolve did not play a role in his quick recovery. Which brings us to our topic for today's show, perseverance. (laughs) Perseverance. That might be a new word to some of y'all, but I want you to pay attention because that might be the most important word in the English language. Perseverance isn't talent, it's not strength, it's not intelligence. The only way to measure it is with results. And the energy that you need to have is Joe Biden. I think they got Joe it. Biden's yeah. got the right kind of energy. I think they got it. Anyways, the point is Joe Biden has perseverance. Brittany That's right. Griner has perseverance. That's right. And she's currently being sexually she's, jailed. She's being jailed. By, yeah. by Donald Putin himself. That's correct. And today on the Adam Friedland Show... We're going to show you how to persevere. 